Hello and welcome to the John Ark Show. Today's episode is called All Homes Being Sold Now Will Keep Dropping in Price. Before we begin, I want to encourage you to subscribe to our channel for free. You can also like, comment, and follow us. We're going to have a lot of great celebrity interviews coming up, so make sure to click on that notification bell so you can be notified every time we upload a new episode. Also, we ask that you post a link to today's show on all your social media to help get the word out. Now, let's get started. Every home being sold now will continue to drop in price. Not just some of them, almost all of them. Every home sold in the last 24 months will continue to see price drops. Not just some of them, almost all of them. Why is that? It's the interest rates, it's market trends, and most importantly, too many homes have been dumped on the market recently, and this is driving down the values of all homes. I just checked some multi-million dollar properties in the last hour or so, and uh, some of them have gone down six to $20,000 in the last month. Too much supply now and not enough demand. In fact, there is so much panic selling going on now that some realtors are almost overwhelmed by the sheer volume of homes being splashed onto the market. So what happens when people see all this and panic selling uh, increases? Well, they start panic selling themselves and they start putting their homes on the markets. And so the panic increases and drives down prices even faster for more homes. That's how this works. That's how it gains speed and momentum. So, what can you do if you just bought a house? Nothing. The prices are going to keep dropping no matter what you do. All you can do is ride it out. Now, if you want to minimize your losses, you may want to sell your house immediately and then just start renting something. You could move into an apartment, for example, or rent out a house. So how far and how bad will it get? A lot of people seem to believe that this is the forever bubble. Meaning, when, the, when this bubble pops and prices go to the bottom, they're staying there. They don't think that the economy will ever come back again, and this is all being done deliberately to destroy everything. Who knows if that's true or not, but this time it definitely feels dif different than previous economic downturns. What can people do? Well, a lot of people are buying positive cash flow generating assets like real estate or businesses and they're going to try and live off that for a while. Other people are eliminating all their debts. Lastly, a number of people are standing on the sidelines now and they're avoiding buying anything until the price hits bottom. So, uh, we'll have to wait and see where this all goes. Until then, good luck and thank you for watching. I want to encourage you to subscribe to our channel for free. You can also like, comment, and follow us. We're going to have a lot of great celebrity interviews coming up, so make sure to click on the notification bell so you can be notified every time we upload a new episode. Also, we ask that you post a link to today's show on all your social media to help spread the word. Thank you, and we shall see you soon. Bye-bye.